Alright. Hello everybody, welcome, welcome to a very exciting live stream and episode of Little Nightmares Part 2. Or Little Nightmares 2, however you want to call it. But yes, this is very exciting! I, so, yes, in case you guys haven't seen me play the first game, um, I will leave the link um, to watch the the first playthrough on the bottom of the of the description so that way you guys can watch it and um that way you can catch up uh you can catch up to see what's been going on uh since the first uh first part now i don't know what this one is about first one was about us in the boat and a bunch of stuff was going on and i had no clue what was well it was such an interesting very interesting story yeah it takes place in a boat. We don't know it's a boat yet, not until later. And it's a huge, huge boat. Why? Because you, as the main character, are this little tiny little thing. A tiny little nightmare. <laughs> well, I don't know. And um, so you're like these tiny little characters, and you come across these huge, huge, creepy looking monsters, or I don't know if they are people, but we call them monsters because they look terrifying. Some have long arms, some have big heads, some look terrifying, some are scary. And also guys, to give you a heads up, this is a, this game could be a little scary <laughs> because the first one was pretty creepy. Um, I had no idea what to expect for the first game, but as I continue to play it, it did get creepy and creepy and fun, then a little scary. <laughs> and our, our, I guess the main, if I remember correctly, the fate, the main thing that we had to do in the first game was just find a way to escape from the boat. And when we do, we learn that, oh, the world is a much bigger place when we when we escape the, the, the big boat with all these giant monsters or people that are trying to eat us. That's another thing. These big monsters or people, whatever they're called, they're trying to eat us. They're trying to kill us. Us little nightmares. And so I guess in this one, we finally make it to the big city. So I don't know what to expect, but I'm very excited. Well, we're going to get started in a few seconds. Woohoo! Hello, big boss. Hello, guys. Hello, how's everyone? Good morning, Metal. All right, guys, are you ready? I, I can't wait any longer. I can't wait any longer. We have to get started. Let's get started. Press start. Uh, updated April 1st, 2020. Please read the... Uh, uh, no, thank you. Hey, no! We, re we really have to read it? Okay, so... Oh. Worst case scenario, you could die. Sign the agreement. Alright. Brightness. Adjust the slider until the eyes is barely visible. I like the soundtrack. By the way, guys, in the first game, I loved the soundtrack. It's so good. I hope this is good. Little Nightmares to access data. Please do not switch off your power. Okay. Woohoo! Here we go, guys. Uh, chapter selection, settings. One second. Master volume. English. Brightness. Okay, let's go back. All right, new game. Boom. You can be one of the people bad at the end of a sham while wow, insane stuff super slow. Fast, but not slow, my bad. <laughs> okay, okay. said I whoa oh here we are 
Oh, cutie. Hello, little one. Oh, and by the way, I forgot about the graphics. Some, some of the graphics in this game was pretty good, especially in the first one. For a little indie game. Ugh. Hold on, I'm getting myself comfortable. Ah, there we go, I got a stretch. I'm so excited! You and me both, bo uh, boy guzzy. Alright. So. Oh, we're so tiny. So we're now in this forest. I forgot how to... I forgot some of the controls. Can you go that way? No, you can't. I hope they teach us how to use the controls again, because I forgot how to play this game. That's how you crouch. That's how you run. Oh, and some of the shots from the first game was so beautiful. For a creepy game like this, like, the background and everything else was just so beautiful. There were so many wonderful shots. Like right now, this looks so beautiful. <coughs> oh, oh, what is this? I have no idea what that is. And also guys, for those of you who are new to my channel, remember I'm the type of player that likes to take his sweet ass time looking at everything. Eh. Come on, boy. Because you never know what you might find. Secrets, ammo, death. <laughs> Why is it that when you land on this, there's paper or rocks? I don't know if it's rocks or something. Let's jump! Look, is it, isn't these one of the, the cages that were from the first game? That's where we where, where they locked us up? That's little nightmares. That's how you grab. Oh no, crouch. They don't show you how to press buttons anymore. Hello! <gasps> oh no, guys. Okay, you see, that's what I'm talking about. This is a shoe, isn't it? And then look over here. I think that's a big bag of bodies. I could see arms, legs sticking out. Okay, what the heck is going on here? I remember in the first game, when we first saw that hanging body, I was like, all right, this ain't no kid's game. We got a shoe. Shu, you will accompany me on my adventure. Um. <laughs> okay, so that's how you throw. Throw that. That's how you grab. So it's kind of like Fall Guys. No, no, no. There you go. Yeah, we're taking the shoe with us. We need to cut. Oh, I thought I heard something in the back. We need a companion. This shoe will be our friend. Oh my. No, no. I can't. I can't get him any. Ah! I have to let you go, shoe. I'm sorry. Goodbye, my old friend.
<laughs> I couldn't grab it anymore. What's this? Was that? Are there more dead bodies? What's this? Oh look, there's a. Why does that eyeball on the on the bottom right corner pop out? <gasps> no, wait. This could be a trap. Shoot. Well, now there's no turning back. There's no turning back. Can you go around? You can't. Is there something here that I could pick up? Let's see if we can trigger it. No! Okay. I just wanted to trigger it. Oh, they're leaves. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, that's enough. There's another eyeball. Are there a bunch of traps in here? It looks like it. Pressing the wrong button. Crouch into the rabbit hole. Our first death. <laughs> Damn it! No! No! Oh, it's a sprint! A sprinting! <laughs> Second death. Okay. Run! 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 Oh! Oh, we really have to run. There's no dot. There's no like avoiding that. Rock? No, I can't pick you up. You're too heavy. No. Okay. Oh, there's a rope up there. No, wrong button. Don't press that button. Nope. Can we go up there? No? Aha! Hold on, let's 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 see what's over here. Okay, so what's the story with this guy? Why are we in the forest? Why is he just in the forest? And he's in an area where there's a lot of traps. Uh, uh, let go! There we go. 
I zone out for a few seconds and I see Davis swinging from a noose. <laughs> I'd already died two times, boy Guzzy. I got ran over by a log, a rolling log. Oh. No. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, okay, so we're gonna have to jump across. Okay. Jeez, yep. I don't understand how this works. Climb up, fool! Climb up! There you go! Okay. I still need to get the hang of this. Made it! Okay. Oh, that looks pretty. Oh my. What's with the creepy sound? All for nothing. Oh! <laughs> oh! Sorry. We didn't make it. Oh, you got the new chair already? On Discord and a little video about my doggo that, that plays in the snow. Oh, how cute! I'll be sure to check it out, Metal. So, oh, come on, little one. Let's try again. Sorry about that. But how do we get across then? Um, so did your chair already come in middle? So how do we get across? Hmm. Oh, so it came in yesterday. Okay, okay, okay. I'll be sure to check it out, buddy. By the way, how's everything? How have you been so far, uh, Metal? How's everything? It's perfect for my back. Ah. Uh -huh. Come on, man. What am I supposed to do? There's nothing else I can do, so... Let's try it again? No. Ow! It sounds so painful! Poor little one. Okay. Oh, and I had a lot of stuff to do with my audio recording and stuff. Ooh, that crack. I know, man. It sounds so ugly. So I don't know what to do. Oh! Oh. Uh. Oh, there, I see that. Come on, little one. I see that there's like a little secret passage. Are we going to go back? Most probably. No? Mm -hmm. Never mind. I thought there would be this, like a little secret passage. Oh, we're gonna have to do this again. Okay, let's see now. Let go! Ah. There we go. Okay, so I need to work on... You just wanted to swing again. <laughs> Maybe. Because they look cute. 
They look cute when they're swinging. I don't get how this thing works. Oh, now it's working. I just, I guess we just gotta turn it slow. Okay. I guess we just gotta turn that thing slow. But I don't get what we're supposed to do here now. Hmm. Okay, there we go, there we go. Okay, there we go. <gasps> no! I thought there was nothing! Okay, never mind. Poor little one. Poor little one. Come on, little one. Let's try again. Okay, now that we see that there's an opening over here. Ah! Oh, oh, oh! Okay, no, he's good. He's good, guys. He's okay. There we go. Now we can climb. Climb, 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 climb. Alright. I like the I like the way it looks, like the background and everything. It looks very nice. And I like our mask. Ugh. Give me one moment. <sighs> I hate my back. Oh, hold that. I'm getting comfortable. You scared my wife with your scream, Davis. I'm so sorry, Tyler. I'm sorry, Metal. <sighs> okay. So, anyways, uh, let's see here. <gasps> oh, sorry. My room is must. Must have said something, and now it smells like strawberries. Then we get another shoe. So we keep seeing a, a lot. We keep seeing a lot of people's shoes and bodies. So I'm pretty sure we're in a very dangerous area in the forest. She has the best taste. Oh no! Oh, I see something. I see something. Get on the rope. No, guess not. Woohoo! Welcome to Michigan. <laughs> Wait, why do you say that, boy Guzzy? Hello? Hmm, nothing in there. Hmm. A lot of shoes and bodies. That's terrible. I see a bear. Oh! Davis, you fool! Don't step on those! I was about to step on it! And I looked at the others. Th these, th these are bear traps, guys. Oh my goodness. I was about to step on it. Michigan is a very dangerous place. So it only makes sense. It all makes sense now. I was about to step on this bear trap. Oh, I need to be very careful. These things are... Imagine? And this this character is so tiny and skinny, poor things. These things would have snapped me in half. Careful, little one. Some people have already triggered them. Gotcha. Now we have a weapon. A sword. A stick sword. I was dying of laughter because I thought you were going to walk on and walk to it. <gasps> Thank God I wasn't. I was close to because I thought, oh, what is this? 
and then when I saw the other bear traps, I was like, oh no, Davis, hold on! But shit! My goodness! Imagine if that was us. Oh my goodness, that would have been horrible. I'm just trying to see what else we can find over here. Doesn't look like there's anything else. Alright, let's continue. Whee! No bear traps! Okay, ah! Oh, poor little one. Alright, oh my goodness. Um... It's full of leaves. It's full of leaves. I don't trust it. Ah! Whew. Do I have another? Do I have another? I need another stick or rock, please. I don't want to step on any more dangerous things. Oh, shoot. Please be careful. <laughs> I am pretty sure there's like a... Alright, get ready to run, Davis. Get ready to run. Ready? Ready? <laughs> okay. Right now, there's another one. Can we... Shoot, way to go. Nice aim. Alright. <laughs> oh! Now, who in the world would put kind of bear traps like this? Darn. Ah! Really? Really? <laughs> hey, hey, Soul. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing? We're here. Please don't step on a bear trap. Welcome, welcome, buddy. How are you doing? How's your weekend going? Oh, Lord. Can I get this? Okay. Okay. Please, I'm so scared, I don't want to scream! Eh. Is this little nightmares? Yes, sir. Yes, it is. And just in case... Just in case... No spoilers, no... No hints, no nothing that would possibly... Uh, give any spoilers to this game. We all want to have a nice experience not knowing what to expect, so... Just in case. Just a, a, a friendly reminder. Put this over here. Oh, look! We got more of those. We got more. Oh my god, there's more stuff. Boy, because they scream, my friends. Scream! <laughs> they'll hear you and they'll find you. <gasps> you never played it? Ooh, you're, just, you're in for a treat, soul. Yeah, the first one was scary. <laughs> oh! Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Alright, now we know. We know. Shoot. Hold on, hold on. I see a bear trap right there. Or maybe not. Yeah, pick this up. Pick this up. You missed Davis swinging. Yeah, I was swinging on a rope. Oh, this is too scary. Ah. Come here. I need I need your help, little one. I need you to be the sacrifice. That's cool. So, more keeps falling down. Well. 
I wish we had the stick. The stick seems to be a lot more... Um... Oh, this reminds me of Limbo. I wonder... You're right, So I wonder if it's from the same creators. Oh, there's a bed trap right there. Hang on. Knowing me... Knowing cl clumsy me... No, fool! I keep... I need to get used to the buttons. No! Stop it! I need to get used to the buttons. Grab it. Ah! Well, there's no... Please. Please, I just want to get... I, I want to grab this thing. There we go. Ah! I'm dead! I'm dead! Damn it! Well, now we know what happens when we get... When we touch those things. Ah. Alright, let's try again, little one. Ever played Limbo or Insight? I have not yet, I have not played any of those two games, uh, so. But it does look similar to that. I don't trust it. I know it's not, it's, it's a different studio. Oh, okay, but it's very similar vibe. They do have that similar vibe. Hold on a second. Where are you? Alright. Uh, okay. Alright, here we go again. Uh, uh. <laughs> Shoot. Over there. No, fool. You threw it the wrong way. Jeez. Okay. Okay. No, 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 pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. <laughs> okay. Jeez, then they're loud too. All right, pick that up. That's <laughs> That's how I keep my boy safe. My home safe. But boy Guzzy, I, I must cross. I need to cross your your land. Please, sir. Okay, that's enough. Let's just go for it. Oh! oh! There we go. All right, we made it. We made it. <gasps> hey, and hold on. Did I miss something over there? Adrian, how are you? Welcome, welcome. I couldn't live. I couldn't live in my room. It gets taken by the darkness of Detroit. All right, let's investigate. Let's go further. This looks nice. And yes, so the game is creepy. Oh, that soundtrack too. Oh my goodness, it's a house. Are we in Resident Evil 8? I mean, Resident Evil 7. Biohazard. Welcome to the family, son. Please don't listen to me. <laughs> I get to trip You're just being silly, boy, Guzzy. Uh, Detroit is scary. This is really gives me limbo inside vibes. All right, Ken, you will accompany me. Oh, wait, hold on. Let's wait right here, Ken. Is there any secrets? Doesn't look like it. But notice there's a lot of these small cages here. So that must mean one of the monsters or the, the big giant people live here. The ones that, the ones that eat us. We need a flashlight. If only we had a flashlight. Alright, Ken, you will accompany me in this house. K, 
can up in it. Play Dead, the studio that made Inside and Limbo are working on a game currently. A new game? <gasps> the window's open over here. Adrian Goodman, waiting all night for this stream. Oh, nice! <laughs> well, here we are, Adrian, and I'm so sorry I haven't streamed in a couple of days, but here I am. Here I am, and I'm so excited to be playing this game and streaming it live for you guys. Especially, quit throwing it on the side! Especially for those who haven't seen any of this gameplay or not familiar with the story. It's my pleasure to introduce it to you. Ah! All right. Like I said, this can is going to accompany me in here. Ah! Now wait for me inside. Don't go anywhere. Ew. Ooh, someone's making tea. You might play these games at some point. They're really good. The first game is really, really good. Shh. Someone could still be here. What the heck is that on the table? It looks like body parts. This is definitely my house. <laughs> I need a flashlight. Hopefully we can get a flashlight soon. Um... Oh, we made it. We made it. Okay, so what is he eating here? Mm, a foot? Imagine you walk into the kitchen and you see like something like this standing on your table. That's creepy. <laughs> Minus the body parts. What would you rate these games? The first one, I would definitely give it like... Um, well, I'm not really good at rating, but I would say it's really a good indie game. Because for a person like me, not knowing what to expect, I thought it was going to be like a cute kid's game. And then all of a sudden it just turns out to be like this really creepy, disturbing, fun, adventurous game with a very, very interesting story where it's not clear of like what's going on, but you can't help but to like feel attracted to the to the art, the style of it. Because like I said, you see like this moment, this is a very nice screenshot. I think this game has a lot of very nice artistic um, shots at times. And it has a very nice texture of like light and shadow, light and dark. So uh, I, I would say it's a good game. The first one. Second one, we'll wait and see until we pass it. It does look nice. I care of the attacks. It's getting these hands. <laughs> And smacking the living head out of that of that creature. If it's in my house. <laughs> what are you doing here in my kitchen? I swear to god if those cookies are missing, I know it was you. <gasps> Shh. Look, another inch a very beautiful shot right here. Imagine this little guy walking up to you like this, guys. Come and play with us. We'll be friends forever and ever. And ever. <laughs> no, okay, that's enough, that's enough. Anyways. Hello? I come inside your home looking for food. <gasps> ah! What's going on? Oh, I found something. Equip collected hats. <gasps> oh, in the pause menu. Oh, so we can collect hats. Because I, l I like wearing hats over this paper bag. Hmm. I punched the heck out of it. <laughs> nope. Well, someone is definitely playing some music. Alright, Mr. Shu. You will accompany me. You'll be my friend for now. I don't like being alone in this world. You're a pretty big shoe, so I'm gonna call you 8-inch. <laughs> I swear on my back limbs that that thing is gonna be squished like a banana if it walks towards me saying, Come play with us. Do you have any cookies? <laughs> 
Hello? Or imagine like, here, you were looking for your shoe? I found it. Here you are. There you go, so you can get ready for work. I still squash it. <laughs> Hello? Hold on, Mr. Shoe. Hold on, Mr. Shoe. You can't. I wonder why, though. <gasps> okay, so it's gonna take us to the basement. In that case, I'll give it cookies. <laughs> This house reminds me of the house from Res Resident Evil Biohazard. Oh? There's something on the other side, though. But we can't get to there. It just shows us a little bit of, like, what's in the... <gasps> Guys! Can you move the camera? Oh, my God! Do you see that? You see that? I forgot that you can move the camera a little bit. But do you see that? There's a huge person sitting in that table. Can we zoom out a little bit more? And it looks creepy. I don't know if it's dead or a dummy, but it looks creepy. Are they alive? I'm not sure. I'm definite. I'm pretty sure once we go to the other side, it's going to come come to life all of a sudden. All right, so since we can't get across uh, to any other doors left and right, let's just go, I guess, to the basement. Hello. I like the music box. Are they huge or normal size? And you're small. Well, in the first game, we find out that there are other... There are, like, these monsters that are bigger than us. But we're not sure if they're humans. Or just monsters. Because they look like people, but... Like... Disturbing looking. Scary looking. Some have long arms. Some have big heads. Some have really huge bodies. And they want to eat us. Throw the shoe at the door. I can't... I can't... Bring my my shoe friend with me, though. Shh. Can we get back up? Yes, we can. Can we get the cleaver? We can't get the cleaver. Attack on Titan. <laughs> Pretty much. Where's the music box coming from, Mr. Stringball? You'll you'll be my friend for now. Okay. Mr. Stringball, wait here for me. You can't push it. You can't push it. Is that a person? I'm not sure, but he looks like my size. It could be like one of my one of my kind. There are others that are like me, tiny, and we're all trying to to survive from these giant monsters. But I like, I like the music box. It sounds nice. No way. Come on now. What am I supposed to do? There we go. Ah! What are we supposed to do? Hmm. What about over here? There's a giant axe. It's funny how the light is, like, on it. <sighs> Alright, now we got a weapon. Ooh, I feel like... That's so cool, I feel like... The Axeman from Resident Evil... Resident Evil 5, or... Pyramid Head from Silent Hill. That's so cool. The music is getting intense with the music. With the music box. Hey, Zetsy, how are you? Welcome. How are you doing? Welcome, welcome. I don't think there's anything else I need to... Hold on. Wait here, Mr. X. Maybe there's something else in here? No, I can't. Alright, well, it doesn't look like there's anything else in this room for me. 
doing good, buddy. Good to hear, Zetsy. Welcome. Alright, maybe we need to use this axe to... <gasps> Please! Oh, I thought somebody was coming in. I was like, there's nowhere to hide. Oh yeah, guys, so whenever... If we ever... Eventually we will, but once we encounter these big, huge... People slash monsters, we're gonna have to hide or do our best to run. But since these things are bigger than us, they are a little bit faster. And they'll try to catch us and eat us. Maybe you axe the door down and see? Yeah, let me see. Here's David. Here's Davis. All right, buddy, I'm gonna come in since you didn't want to open the door. Ah! I'm sorry. Don't be scared. Don't be scared, little one. I'm sorry. No, 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 no. I'm your friend. I'm your friend. Here's Davis. <laughs> oh, where'd he go? Hey, I didn't mean to scare you, little one. Hey, you look like the guy from part one. Come here, I mean no harm. What are you doing here? Just playing the music box. <gasps> no, wait! What are you doing? We could work together. Aww. That strange though, why would the little one be playing a music box? Maybe this house is abandoned, there's no one here. But still, if that person from upstairs that was sitting on the table was alive, I think that was kind of dangerous. He looked like the character from the first game, but... Well, if you guys haven't seen the first game, I don't want to spoil anything. Well... Mr. U Music Box, I guess you'll, you'll be my friend now. Since the guy just ran away. Oh, look, he ran. He went upstairs. Wait! Oh, shoot, I dropped it. <laughs> you forgot your music box. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> hey! Ah, oh, goodness. Ah, oh, man, I can't, I can't fit this music box. It's fat shaming it. Oh god, what is that noise? <gasps> wait, 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 wait for me! Oh god. Oh! Oh my god. Okay, so these are dummies. Maybe for comfort. My brothers are spoiling everything for me as I. <gasps> no! Tell your brothers to shh! Like, please, brothers, don't spoil it for me. Can we close the door? Close the door, 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 close Close the door, close the door, close the door! There! Hey! Hold on, little one! What's up with that kid's face? His eyeballs... Kind of disturbing. I'm getting major Resident Evil vibes here. I know, right? Welcome to the family, son. Ah! There's some loud noises coming from the other side. Alright, we gotta catch up with that little one. Ah! Hey, no, 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 what are you doing? Um, can we get... Ah. What's going on? Why are there dummies here? The music is creepy. Ew. Eh! Food fight! Food fight up in this bitch! <laughs> Stop body shaming. Mm. I wonder though, guys. Are these like... Are they dolls? Or are they really like... People that were just turned into dolls. Cause that boy's face is really convincing. Okay, well anyways, let's just keep going. Okay. What are you doing? You need help? Hey, I could help you. 
Hey, 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 don't run away from me. I'm not gonna do anything. I'm your friend. Bye. Yes. Okay, yeah, he trusts us now. I'm coming. This has to be a Resident Evil Easter egg. That lady had the nurse zombie face. Oh! Bye. From Silent Hill? Press Z to be, to be hoisted. Hang on, buddy. I'm just looking around really quick. Yeah, I know, I know. Shut up. Hold on. I'm just looking around really quick. You never know if I might find some hats. Remember, guys, um, I could find hats here and collect them. I'm getting the games mixed up. <laughs> What's locked? Okay, 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 okay. Well, just in case, guys, I'm going to save this clip from my YouTube channel, so let me save it. For those of you guys who will be who are watching me live on my Twitch channel, stay tuned because we're going to continue on with this adventure of Little Nightmares 2. And for those of you guys who will be watching this on my YouTube channel, thank you so very much for watching. We hope you enjoyed this episode of Little Nightmares 2, and we hope to see you in the next one. Take care of yourselves. Laters!